Good morning, this is Kim Danke coming to you with today's daily devotion. Today's devotion is called, I am in constant prayer. I am in constant prayer. The verse is Romans 12, 12. Be joyful in hope, patient in affliction, faithful in prayer. At the beginning of the new year, Julie had every intention of reading her Bible every day and praying at a specific time. She did well for the first week or so, but when she started slipping, then she started slipping. Having a set time to read and pray didn't always work out for her, and she often ended up feeling guilty if she missed out. Maybe you're like Julie. You've tried to get into the routine of reading and praying at the same time every day. For many people, this works great. Others have a harder time sticking to a set schedule. What while it's a great idea to try to read a certain number of chapters a day or pray for a certain length of time, what's really important here is maintaining a desire to meet with the Lord and spend time with Him. It's your heart He's after, not a certain number of minutes. Imagine you had a really good friend and you talk, that you talked with every day. She was your go-to person whenever you had a problem. The two of you pretty much shared everything. Then one day, she married and moved away to another state. You still saw each other on social media and occasionally spoke by phone, but she was now happily married and not as free to talk all the time. You would miss her, right? Most of all, you would miss the intimate conversations and the comfort you felt just by knowing you had someone you could turn run to. Now think about that in light of prayer. God is the ultimate one we can go to when we are needing someone to listen. Those intimate conversations you're lacking with your friend, the Lord is hoping you'll want to share them with him. That's what prayer is, a sweet one-on-one -on -one conversation with someone you love. And who loves you more than the one who created you? So stop thinking about prayer as a have-to thing. It's not a drudgery. It's a sweet conversation in passing. It's a lengthy, pour-out-your-heart episode. It's a quick rush, please protect me. It's a quiet, thank you for your blessings, Father, followed by a list of things you're most grateful for. It's a tearful, I don't get it, Lord, when things are falling apart, and a praise the Lord, hallelujah, when all is going well. In short, prayer is a day-in, day-out conversation with God. He doesn't care if you meet with Him at 6 a.m. or noon. What matters to Him is the desire to come to Him with all of your cares, concerns, joys, and sorrows. He will meet you there and wipe away every tear. I hope that y'all have a great and wonderful and perfect day.